so hi everyone welcome to indra mrd channel in this video we're going to talk about what to expect when you arrive on the first time on board the cruise ship and jangan lupa aktifkan subtitlenya all right guys after a long flight finally I am arrived in the hotel so now I am in the uh, Holiday Inn Hotel so I will stay here for one night and the next day we will join the ship uh, to the port of Long Beach so tomorrow 8 o'clock in the morning they will pick us up everybody together and then we'll join the ship and start working all right Okay, so that was my trip, 20 hours on the plane until I get here in the Los Angeles, California. We arrived at the airport at around 7.45 in the evening and then the problem over there was we taking so long time, like more than one hour to wait for the shuttle bus going to hotel that they assigned for us to stay and then the next day at 8 o'clock in the morning we go to the cruise port and then we join the ship so here I want to share what happened the step by step how uh, you join the ship and then you start working okay when we arrived in the cruise port which is the Long Beach port we were welcome from the HR team so before we can go uh, inside the ship we need to do the antigen test first when you prove a negative and then we bring that uh, test going inside to the ship from the terminal after the test we proceed to the uh, ship to the gangway so when we arrive there we need to do the security check after we finish the security check there was uh, two tables one is for the document check and the other one is for the medical check so as soon as we pass the security check they will guide us to go to these two tables so the first thing is the uh, medical check so you need to give the medical and also the PCR test result that you do back home in your home country before your travel and also the proof of the vaccination and the last one is the uh, negative result antigen test that you just did in the terminal okay when everything is ready so you go to the next table which is the uh, document check from there you will give the the passport and also the simon book okay. everything is okay from there then they will give you the cabin key and one uh, folder with all the information about the ship so about the management 
security information, your cabin, your meal, everything, and also the schedule for the vessel familiarization. Right after we finish here with this two table, and we can proceed to our cabin. And at 1:30 p.m., we need to be in one lounge and they will do the vessel familiarization what happened on the first day when you enter the ship you must be confused because you have no idea what is it where is it and how to find your cabin the tips is don't afraid to ask yeah ask question to any team member and don't be afraid because they're gonna help you right you have the key with the cabin number and then you just ask where is the cabin number let them guide you and you proceed to the cabin so I put my stuff in the cabin I don't change my clothes yet because the time was already 1130 so since this is the lunch time so I proceed to the crew mess very important don't skip this lunch because after that you have familiarization and the rest you have no time to eat so lunch times very important make sure you have time for the lunch time first so during the family session all the senior officer management will come and introduce themselves they will come you on board and they introduce themselves one by one and you know already who your boss is on the family session also they will talk about the safety about your uh, health safety and also security that's the most important things and they will give you the emergency card so this uh, emergency station bill card is very important that is a small card that will guide you in case of emergency what is your number because when you go to the emergency station they will not call you by name but they will call you by the number so you need to know the number and what you need to do in case of emergency fire emergency or any kind of emergency is written on that card and if you have any emergency duty also written there so all full information is on that card and that is very important and you will not lose that one okay after the vessel preparation finish and then the department representative will pick you up they will separate you by the department and they will take you around to all the master station okay after complete this training after finish everything and then that representative will bring you to the department and they will tell you uh, how is your work how is your schedule they give you the uniform and they give you the schedule so how was my feeling when my, when my first day arrived here i will tired because of the trip and then when I arrive at the hotel, I cannot sleep because my mind is going here and there. So I keep thinking about home, I keep thinking also about job, nervous. Even though this is not my first time, but when you joining the new ship, uh, you have no idea. And this is my first time coming on this class of ship. So the good things for me because I have the experience, so I know, uh, I know the basic of the job. So to find uh, where is the place or what is where so it's, it's easier for me when you meet with new people new team and of course you're gonna need time to be familiarize yourself and get used to it so that was my experience so for the first second week that's gonna be your time to learn and familiarize yourself about the ship situation and more and getting longer and longer and you will be okay and that's gonna be your normal life on board a cruise ship so by the way I'm here in Carnival Radiance so I'm gonna talk more about the Carnival Radiance here on the next video so don't forget to subscribe this channel if you're interested how is the cruise ship life really like so subscribe this channel and if you watch it until now don't forget to click the like button now down below that means a lot to me all right thank you for your support and i'll see you again in the next video thank you so much ciao ciao